Hello, let's see how to fix this motor position. So, first, to have something right in the middle of my scene to prepare everything, I will reset the position of the wall move and rotate motors. So, we'll double click on position and apply. So, now that everything has moved, I select it, press O on the keyboard to recenter on it. So, from now, I have in the programmer nothing set it's all at 50 percent on x y z and the same for the rotation and this is quite abnormal to have the motor position here and your anchor things here so i will expand everything until founding your own group here you have a chess group with transformation which is quite strange at here when i look at the moco motor anchor it's at zero 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 and we can see that the position of this motor anchor is there while the truss is something below which is quite not good for the motoring so i will reset the position of the trusses and now the truss group and the motor anchor it's at the same position so that means all the chain will act correctly from this position. Then I will check the rotation first. So for the rotation X, I have minus something plus something and it is symmetrical. So that means at the off of the rotation command here, I'm off of the position, I'm uh, at the nominal. If I'm going forward, rotating forward, if I'm going backward it's rotating backward so like that i can have a position forward backward and i can play with it and that's the same for all the rotation so for the rotation there is no issue then about the move position tra translation i can see that on the move the position min and max has been moved with something not symmetrical so you cannot move backward forward you can just move from this position plus 24 centimeters at the minimum and then at maximum it's 2000 meters which is not correct for those way working of the motor at the beginning so we will set something like minus 1000 plus 1000 like that we have up of the y-axis something symmetrical i will redo the same for the z and the x so I can select the both, define new position, new wrench, and from now on, I should be good to go. So I will remove everything, so the motor get reset at the right position with a new value I have defined. And so I have the cube of the motor at the same place than the truss anchor. So from here, if I'm starting to play with it it should be fine so i can move around x forward backward the same for y upward downward the same for z going back and then we have all the rotation which is possible on all axis that's all